Are you looking to sell your delicious baked goods? Baking is not only a creative outlet and a great stress reliever, it's also a great business opportunity. While the traditional brick and mortar bakery has its advantages, selling your baked goods from home is a good way to get things rolling since there's a low barrier to entry. You're able to start your business faster simply by using your home kitchen and personal baking utensils. Plus, it's less expensive to start your business from home. Since there's no need to rent a property or build a bakery, most of your budget can go towards buying quality ingredients and marketing your business. Now let's get into the seven steps to start selling your baked goods from home. I'm Noel with JotForm. Let's go. First, you'll have to create a business plan. If you're serious about baking more than a few cupcakes over the weekend, then you should create a business plan that explains how you'll manage your time, finances, and inventory. You should also lay out how you'll market and sell your products. This will serve as a guide that you can reference as you scale your business, making it easier to keep operations on track. Next, you need to have an understanding of the legal requirements of running a home business. Overlooking the laws and regulations on home businesses can lead to a disaster, especially when it comes to food service. You may need to acquire a permit or license to sell homemade food, so check with your local government and state health department before proceeding. If you don't have all of the legalities in order, your business could face some serious penalties. You'll also have to get business insurance. It's important that you have a business insurance policy to safeguard against any potential mishaps. Whether there's a fire in the kitchen or an angry customer claiming to have received a bad batch, business insurance will give you financial protection and peace of mind. Next, register an LLC. An LLC, or a limited liability company, is a business structure that offers business owners limited liability protection and pass-through taxation. This enables owners to declare business taxes on their personal tax returns. But if a limited liability company goes into debt, the debtors can't lay claim to the owner's personal possessions. While selling baked goods from home might start as a hobby for spare change, it's a good idea to do things by the book so you don't lose your home in a lawsuit. Setting up an LLC will protect all of your personal assets. Next, look into all tax regulations. Getting a sales tax permit is often free, but you might need to pay taxes on sales or food items. You can go to your local business information websites or your state government to figure out what taxes you may need to pay. When you put a little bit of money aside each month, you can collect enough to cover your annual sales tax bill when the time comes to file your business tax return. Now it's time to choose your baking niche. You may be tempted to offer as many items as possible, but it's better that you limit your offerings in the beginning. Focus on one or two items that are your specialty and make them better than any of your competitors' similar offerings. Your niche can be something like gluten-free bagels, vegan cookies, or intricately decorated cakes. Having a niche allows you to stand out as a specialist. It also makes it easier to make a name for yourself among a small but dedicated customer group. And your final step is to determine how will you sell your products. You could sell your baked goods in person at your local farmer's market and rely on word of mouth from your friends and family. Or you can accept online orders. JotForm has several easy to use forms that can help you sell your goods online and reach a much wider customer base. Once your business is up and running, you can focus on marketing your business online with photos of your baked goods and memorable branding to stir up interest. Creating an Instagram and Facebook page dedicated to your baking business would be a great place to start. Let's review. In order to start selling your baked goods from home, there are a few important steps that you should keep in mind. First, create your business plan. Then, research the legal requirements for running a home business. Make sure that you get business insurance and register as a limited liability company so that you can protect your assets. Check the tax regulations of your area so that you're paying all necessary taxes. Then all you have to do is choose your baking niche and determine how you're going to sell your products. Well, thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. I'm Noel with JotForm. See you next time. <music>